Hello to everyone. The uptake for today is about the benefit of solutions and the inclusion into the general uh, political discussions. And I'm here with Martin Hoyer, who is a partner at Roland Berger. And they have developed a special tool that manages to calculate the environmental benefit of the solutions that the Solar Impulse Foundation has labeled. And maybe you can explain that because it's quite impressive what you've done. Absolutely, thank you very much. Uh, great speaking to you again. So um, we were delighted to take a look into the solutions of the Solar Impulse um, Foundation and what we found is quite impressive. For countries like Germany, France, Italy, Scotland, they are effective to reduce emissions today by almost 40%. And if you think about it, 40% puts us very close on track to the 1.5 degree target. And this is important because as I see it, the climate train is sort of derailed and we need short-term action in order to get us back on trail and solutions like yours, they are effective to do so. It doesn't mean that we will stay on that rail for the future to reach the future target, but it's a very effective to do so in the now. And how do you believe, Martin, that the international political negotiations could be impacted by, by such a tool, such a proof that the solutions are really environmental friendly and that they can fight climate change? The way I see it, if I look at uh, the negotiations at COP26, the private sector all of a sudden plays a different role. The private sector is really kicking in to the action and this is very good news from my perspective because the private sector goes there where profits to be made in the short term and short term action is what we actually need. So I hope there will be a strong pull from the private sector to implement these solutions in order to get us back on track. Exactly. And we have tools, we have solutions, they are profitable. So we really need to have the political people on board because they have to adapt the regulations to what the technologies are allowing today. Absolutely. So there is hope, but we have to move. Absolutely. <laughs> and we need to act now, and now really means now. And act now with the way we know how to act because act now is not enough. We have to show how. Absolutely. And we are showing how with the benefits, with the solutions, and financial people getting on board. Absolutely. Thank you very much, Martin. Thank you.